Cahirlock. I welcome the opportunity to speak on this issue and I acknowledge the work of Deputy Gino Kenny in bringing it forward. While I certainly accept that Deputy Kenny is motivated by what he believes is the best approach to this issue, I have to say that I cannot support the aim of this bill, which is to make it legally permissible for a person to possess up to a stated amount of cannabis resin for adult personal use. I accept that we should have a lenient approach to persons in the throes of addiction, but effectively removing all legal sanction for possession of what remains a very dangerous drug is something that I cannot support. However, as a study carried out by researchers by the Department of Psychiatry, RCSI and Beaumont Hospital found, cannabis use during youth is of great concern as the developing brain may be particularly susceptible to harm during this period. We also know from research that when 1,600 Australian children aged between 14 to 15 years of, of age were studied for seven years, the ones who used cannabis every day were five times more likely to become depressed and anxious by the end of the study. What I want to see is more emphasis on drug use, prevention and avoidance. I want to end uh, this uh, by, by highlighting once again my contribution. I want to end my contribution here by highlighting that my own counties of Offaly and Leash are profoundly under-resourced when it comes to tackling illegal drugs. As I understand it, there's just one Garda member assigned to the Leash Offaly Drug Division Unit. And indeed, my constituency's local drugs unit had fewer Garda assigned to them than any other unit in this country. And that is unacceptable and needs to change.